Hi there, um, my name's Matt, um, I'm an Naval architect which means um, I design ships for a living. Um, what we're going to talk about today is what stops ships travelling as fast as cars. Um, to do this we've got a nice little demonstration set up, so we've got an ice cream tub um, turned into a little car and it's got some CD wheels on it, um, some sort of uh, skewers making the axles and a nice little sail made out of paper and some more skewers. And we've got its sort of uh, sister vessel as well here which is a little boat made out of exactly the same things but without the wheels. Um, now, now the reason behind this questioning is, um, it, it's Ships are a lot bigger and heavier than cars, so they can't they can't really go they can't really go as fast as they do. Um, the thing is, it's a lot easier for a car to push its way through the air because the air is really thin and it's, it's it's nice and easy to sort of just push your way through it. It's nice sort of light, inviscid fluid. Um, but a ship has to push its way through water. Um, if, you've, if you've ever sort of been in, in, into a swimming pool, you know how hard it is to push, push your way into water, and it's it's not easy at all. Um, so we'll demonstrate this now. We've got um, two sails of about the same size. So using a hairdryer, we can show that the uh, hopefully. The ship, should go, the ship should go slower than the car. Can I someone hold the car on the end of the table? So it doesn't roll off. Okay. So firstly, we'll, we'll just time this, we'll get the car going. And you can see they're nice and quick, and then hopefully our ship should go a little bit slower, because it has to push its way through that water. You see that it turned around, but you can see it, it did go that little bit slower. Um, the other thing as well is that ships are a lot heavier than cars. Um, for, for a typical car, it's only sort of maybe about a ton of steel, and it's only got a sort of small engine in, but you've got quite a lot of power for that weighted car. Um, with a ship, you've got a lot of steel. I mean, you can have as many as maybe, I don't know, sort of 100,000 tons of steel in a ship, and the engine um, is, is a lot smaller compared to the size of the engine in the car. Well, it's, it's still a big engine, but compared to the size of the ship, it's, a, it's relatively small. So we can demonstrate this by putting some extra weight inside the boat. So we do that now with some coins. And hopefully, it should go a little bit slower. You can see there, it went quite a lot slower. Okay, so that's, that's pretty much it. That's why, uh, that's why ships don't go quite as fast as cars. And if you like the video, please feel free to click like below and uh, subscribe if you'd like to see more. Thank you very much.